I moved here with my dog, Rodeo. <laughs> and I'm enjoying being a new resident, but I gotta be honest with you, there's a lot of things that California has that I ain't just, I ain't never seen before. First of all, I ain't never seen this many Mexicans before. <laughs> right? And I was born in Mexico. I heard the other day that, that the census says we are now the majority minority in America. How do you feel about that? <laughs> If you are, I say don't be. I say sit back and like UPS, let us show you what Brown can do for you. <laughs> Get used to LA, it's very different. And LA is one of the only cities in the country where you can drive down the road, look out the window and go, nice breasts, sir. What the? <laughs> it's very weird. To, I read that eight out of 10 homicides in LA are discovered by joggers. Did you know that? Eight out of ten discovered by joggers. You know what that tells me? Maybe cops should jog. Let's <laughs> get their fat ass out running early in the morning. And I have nothing against the police department. I tell you, who I don't like though joggers. All right, these guys can kiss my ass. Cause the only time I ever see them is early in the morning or late at night. To me, that is prime drinking and sleeping time. Right? If I'm up at six thirty, I'm not happy. And there they are. Run for, your, run for your life, dumbass. Your friends will be by for you in a minute. Have you seen the people that walk fast? What are you doing? I'm losing weight. You're losing friends. Cut it out. There's things I've never seen before. I'm walking down the street. I see an oxygen bar. Oxygen bar. They're selling. I walked in. As soon as I walked in, the lady accused me of shoplifting. Hose, put it to your nose, like that'll make you feel good. I said, Bullshit, they gave that to my grandma and she died. <laughs> and I asked questions. I said, Why would I give you good money for something that the trees make for free right outside? And she goes, Because that's only 35% pure. This is 95% pure oxygen. Like the trees are drug dealers all of a sudden. They're stepping on it. <laughs> you just put some bird crap in it. He'll never know the difference. <laughs> Mijito, you be careful. No matter where I go, Mom, at the Grand Canyon, I don't fall. <laughs> no matter where I, no matter what I, you know, I, 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 when I was a kid, I'd get in the car with my mom, and she's driving on the passenger. Every time she hit the brakes, <gasps> <laughs> you know, people like this, oh! <laughs> drive me nuts. I'm about to look at it. I was like, Mother, could you quit with a little arm protection thing? And she was like, I do it because I care about you. <laughs> You do because you can't freaking drive, all right, mother? I mean, let's not confuse that with love. I mean, sure, I survived an accident, but I'm rendered mute from a forearm to the thorax. I spend the rest of my life talking like this. Look, we've all heard those people, they have that thing in their throat from smoking too much. Like at the grocery store, you can hear them eight aisles away. They're like, hey, you're gonna be Darth Vader shop here? What the hell is that noise? And you know what I found out the other night in LA? You can't walk through the drive-thru. My car's in the shop. I was hungry as hell. I got retarded and I'm standing between two cars for 20 minutes. I don't know how the girl knew I didn't have a car. I'm like everybody else. I was like, I don't know what you want to do. I just want to you get back. She goes, sir, are you in a car? Yeah. She goes, I can't hear your engine. So I went, Ooh. I confused her and got to eat. You know what I found out while I was there? You can now use your credit card at Burger King. Did you know that? Yeah. Who the hell is this? Well, let's face it, if you're deferring the payment of a burger, you're a loser. You're rubbing elbows with Wimpy. Yeah, they're gonna look out glad they pay you November for a hamburger today. Could you imagine going to this place and hitting your credit limit? <laughs> Sir, I'm real sorry, but you can't supersize. <laughs> they say LA changes people, you know? I don't know, only time will tell, but I'll tell you right now, my dog, she won't come unless I call her Rodeo. 
She's an uppity bitch. My mother's worried about me. My mother is worried. I call her the other day. I said, Mom, I'm living in Hollywood. Hi, me, he's so big girl. I said, what's wrong with Hollywood? She said, sometimes boys like boys. 